Medium Mentor, 10 Powerful Techniques to Awaken Divine Guidance for Yourself and Others, by Marianne DeMarco, is a guidebook designed for individuals seeking to develop or enhance their intuitive abilities and to connect with spiritual guidance. Marianne DeMarco, a psychic medium, shares her insights and techniques for tapping into one's innate spiritual gifts to provide guidance both for oneself and for others. The book offers a practical and down-to-earth approach to spirituality, emphasizing the accessibility of these abilities to every person willing to explore them. The book starts by addressing the significance of opening oneself up to divine guidance. DeMarco emphasizes the idea that everyone has the potential to access their spiritual abilities and guides. She asserts that connecting with spiritual guides and harnessing intuitive powers is not exclusive to a select few but is a universal capability that can be nurtured and developed. One of the core messages of the book is the importance of intuition as a tool for spiritual communication. DeMarco describes intuition as an ever-present compass that is often overlooked or ignored in the modern, logical world. By tuning into this inner guidance system, individuals can unlock profound insights and receive messages from the spirit world, which can often provide clarity and direction in their lives. The techniques outlined in the book are divided into practical exercises designed to help the reader develop their mediumistic skills. These exercises focus on various aspects of spiritual work, including grounding, protecting one's energy, meditation, understanding and interpreting symbolic language, and effectively communicating with spirit guides and departed loved far ones. Grounding is one of the first techniques DeMarco highlights. It involves centering oneself and creating a strong connection to the earth to establish stability and balance. Grounding is portrayed as a foundational practice that ensures a secure starting point for any spiritual work, providing a safeguard against becoming overwhelmed by spiritual energies. The concept of energy protection is equally crucial. DeMarco details methods to shield oneself from unwanted or negative energies. This includes visualization techniques, such as enveloping oneself in protective light or imagining a barrier that keeps negative influences at bay. These practices are essential for anyone engaging in spiritual work to maintain their well-being and to ensure that the connections they make are with high vibrational, benevolent spirits. Meditation is another key technique covered in the book. It is presented as a means to quiet the mind and deepen one's spiritual connection. DeMarco explains that regular meditation practice helps individuals to increase their awareness of subtle energies and messages, thus strengthening their intuitive capabilities. DeMarco also delves into the symbolic language of the spirit world. She explains that spirits often communicate through symbols, and understanding this language can be a powerful way to interpret messages. She encourages readers to pay attention to recurring symbols and to trust their instincts when it comes to deciphering their meanings. Effective communication with spirit guides and deceased loved ones is a significant topic in Medium Mentor. DeMarco provides insight into establishing relationships with these entities and offers advice on how to recognize and interpret the messages they share. She outlines respectful and loving methods to invite communication with the spirit world and stresses the importance of having clear intentions when doing so. One of the transformative aspects of the book is the emphasis on trusting oneself and one's abilities. DeMarco encourages readers to have confidence in their intuitive insights and to honor their unique experiences without comparing themselves to others. She insists that everyone's mediumistic journey is personal and that individuals should embrace their distinct paths and progress at their own pace. To assist readers in their spiritual development, DeMarco discusses the role of mentorship and community. She highlights the value of having a mentor who can provide guidance and support, and the importance of being part of a community of like-minded individuals. These relationships can offer encouragement, share knowledge, and provide a space for practice and growth. Throughout the book, DeMarco interweaves personal anecdotes which add an authentic touch and serve as examples of the potential that lies within this work. She shares stories from her own experiences as a medium, illustrating the profound impact that spiritual guidance can have on individuals' lives. 
These accounts are meant to inspire and demonstrate the positive outcomes that can arise from following the path of mediumship. The book also discusses the ethical responsibilities of being a medium, such as the importance of integrity, confidentiality, and the respectful handling of sensitive information received from the spirit world. Diero emphasizes the need to approach mediumship with a sense of service and compassion, with the aim of providing healing and comfort to those seeking guidance. DeMarco wraps up the book by encouraging readers to maintain a regular practice and to integrate the techniques into their daily lives. She reiterates that developing mediumistic skills is a journey that requires dedication and that consistency is key to deepening one's connection to divine guidance. In Medium Mentor, DeMarco provides a comprehensive and accessible roadmap for awakening and nurturing one's spiritual abilities. Through the ten powerful techniques presented, readers are empowered to explore their potential as mediums, to connect with the divine, and to serve as a source of guidance and comfort to themselves and to others. The book serves as a mentor in itself, guiding readers through the world of spiritual communication with practical advice, moral support, and an underlying message of universal connectedness. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.